When it comes to alcohol regulations, Indiana has some of the strictest policies. After all, it's the only state in the country to still ban Sunday sales. Well, a new law is loosening up some of those rules, though. News Channel 15 Sarah Wagner has more from Studio 15. Thanks to Senate Bill 113, you can now get wine shipped to your home without having to visit the winery first. I talked to several local wineries about the new law. They say they're thrilled and call it a step in the right direction for Indiana. It does open up a whole new world. Jeremy Luter owns Country Heritage in Laiato. He says the old law could be a hassle at times. People's even been here before in the past. If they're interested in us shipping now, they'd have to come up and revisit. Um, to sign this piece of paper. The old law required you to come to a winery in person before you were able to ship wine to your home. With the new law, you'll just have to prove your identity electronically. Every winery will be the same throughout the state, so uh, whatever, whatever laws apply to them will also apply to us. Exactly how you will prove your identity and age is yet to be determined. Lawmakers and the Alcohol and Tobacco Commission are still working out some details. The real benefit of it is people that have never been here, that want to try it, that don't want to travel. Eric Harris owns Two E's Winery in Huntington. He says the law gives Indiana a chance to be more competitive in a growing industry. It's really a uh, revenue stream that we've been having a difficult time tapping into and it's because there's so many or had been so many restrictions. Harris also says he's not worried about minors trying to work the new system. Typically kids uh, or minors that are trying to get their hands on alcohol aren't ordering wine online. They've got other interests and wine typically isn't it. Since you have to be 21 or older to sign for the wine when it's delivered, he says the risk of it getting into the wrong hands is low. More than 40 other states have similar laws on the books. It brings us up to par with a lot of the other states. It's another step in the right direction to make us a state where we can compete as a wine industry, not just as a state winery. You'll have to wait a few more months before you place those orders. The law doesn't take effect until July. In Studio 15, Sarah Wagner, News Channel 15.